I have been a part of this community for eight years now. And I've fought and climbed my way to the top. But I've had several ups and downs. In today's video, I am going to be talking about some of those since this is my eighth year in the community. I thought, why don't I take you guys on a little trip and explain to you guys all the ups and downs of my Roblox career. Starting off in two, late 2016, when I first came to Roblox, I didn't know what to think of Roblox at first because, you know, I've seen videos on Roblox and I was like, what is this platform? Then I watched a video from a user named Justin7200 and I said, you know what? I want to play, I want to be on this platform. And, I, and then late 2016, I joined Roblox on my first official account. And my first official account lasted until 2017 or, or 2018. And I've had three accounts on the Roblox. There was my first one, Jakari 17, which ended up getting hacked and I lost that one. There was Jakari 16, I made the first one I ever made in 2016, lost that one in 2018. And then, in the, and then there's this one that I'm on right now, 2800 Jakari. This is my third one and I've had this one ever since. The, my first, the first biggest up of my Roblox career was when I joined Pathfinder in 2017. Because not only did it put me under a mentor, as under one of the higher ranks, and they were my mentor, I've learned a lot. It was a good run. I was there until 2018. 2018 hits. I'm on this account now. You know me, you know. And plus, I was, like I said, I was still in high school around this time in early 2018, you know, exploring other options and doing stuff, crazy things that I probably should never have been doing because, you know, but, you know, when you're in high school, you're, we all know how teenagers are in high school. We're curious about doing stuff. And it's because of stuff like that, that controversies of me started to awake. But like I said, this was early 2017. I haven't even turned 18 yet. I was a couple weeks away from turning 18 when all this stuff started, all the chaos started. And I had to fight and fight to, to get to where I am today because of everything. When people made allegations about me being weird and stuff, I'm thinking all this because because I'm one of the oldest members, number one, and number two is because of certain games I was playing. Yes, I was doing a lot of hangout games, and I didn't know all things about that yet. I didn't know everything about it because, like I said, by early 2018, I was still new to everything on Roblox, so I didn't understand. But now, that was one of my downs. And you know, there are many other ones of those that were against me, you know, being weird. People made allegations about me being a, there were people making allegations about me being a, a manipulator because of how I was with my friend, with certain friends. I'm like, that is, it was such BS. Because I wasn't. And all of this made me go at it with a bunch of other people. And that's how drama ensued. I would hit my prime again. In two th Once everything settled down, I would hit my prime back in 2019. When I revealed... I mean, late 2018 to 2019, when I revealed... I mean, unveiled my newest games, the, T the TCR series. That started dying down. There were other games being created. 2020, 2019 to 2020, the birth of PO.
And you know, like I said, even though it the the drama stuff died down with people where people were thinking about me, people a lot of freak a lot of people started making more of these bold claims about me because of the stuff I I you know because of certain you know just certain things you know for me being weird and like I said every, and everyone is weird in their own way. And you know, that's, and that's just me. 2022 to 2021, 2022, I was quiet for a bit. 2023 is where I would leave the community for a bit. And I joined this Japanese community where I became a geisha for a few months. And and here's the thing, and I was let go because from that geisha community because of one of the stupidest reasons ever. So, and I'm not gonna name drop her. I'm not name dropping anyone. The Okasan for the Okia I was in made this allegation against me that I freaking sexualized her because I said she. She was looking nice for some of her age. When I and first of all, and here's the thing. Like I said, one, she was 19. Two, I literally said, someone literally said this. This was in a voice I was in too. Someone made, someone asked me, did I always flirt her? I'm like, no. I said, yeah, she's nice. She does look nice for her age, but she's not my type. I gave her a compliment. She went and told this person went and told that Okasan, and she made an allegation. And this all turned out to be a this allegation was a total lie. Because I never once did that, and I and I I have so much stuff on her. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do I'm not gonna I'm not gonna expose her for it. I'm not gonna do that. But yeah, that and many allegations against me are not true because her saying that made me look bad and made everyone in that community hate me, even though I knew she was lying. And she was doing it to get attention, manipulating everyone. But now, but then that was chaos. There was that. Now, so the being weird and stuff allegations. That allegation from from Gion, those were false. There's lots of shit. People's controversies and shit. People make against me to make me look bad when I'm not that uh, bad of a person in the first place. And I know that. And most of the stuff you, s a lot of people do this and why I'm you're like, here's the thing. I had a hard time growing up. That's why you see some of the sh That's why, you know, when I get into arguments with people, I get very defensive. That's due to how I was growing up and stuff. My life growing, how I was growing up, had an effect on me being older now, how I am when I'm, you know, when there's drama. But those were those were most of my downs in this community, but I'm not letting those downs affect me. But on the bright side, I have a lot of ups on the road from my robots career. And I know there's probably going to be a controversy of people saying in the RCC that I cheated my way to the top, and it's, it's to establish myself as one of the, the one of the big things in this community. Not true. I worked my butt off for this community to get here, to the point that I'm at.
So the reason I'm making this video is to start a trend to learn. I want every, I'm trying to start a trend to have I want everyone to make a video talking about their journey on Roblox. Mine's full of ups, downs, controversies, and the moral of the story, you may, there are some things in life that are going to catch up to you, and even though you do certain things, there's always that one, there's always people who probably do the same things. So that, like, I've had a, a wild ride draw Roblox. And I hope this ride continues. So, uh, like I said, I want everyone to make a video. I want people. I wanted. I wanted people to make a video talk about their journey on Roblox and how they got to where they are. This was me making mine. Everything I went through and how I had to fight to get to the position that I'm in. So, with that said, thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you guys for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to leave a like. Comment down below what you think of my journey. And one more thing I will say. Acknowledge me.